But now, though, I'm joined by Jack Quant. Raised by a single mother in Baltimore, he created the matchmaking website Quantify, and he claims to have found an algorithm for love. And he's here today to tell us all about his number one bestseller, Quantum Leap. It is absolutely wonderful to have you on our sofa today. Thank you. It's great to be here. Now, we'll talk all about your new book soon, obviously. Yes. But first, let's talk about romance. Quantify has found true love for millions. Mm. Coming to two. Does it work for you? Now, if I answer that, can we go back and talk about the book? Maybe. <laughs> can you please try not to shack him on air? This is Dynamite. Tell us to flirt with him more. Some people had their first crush uh, on Farrah Fawcett. My first crush was an algorithm. And we've lost them. If he carries on talking about algorithms, I'm cutting to the VT of cats who look like Hitler. I'm back to four. Love it. Thank he's you. He's avoiding the question. Get him off maths. Ask him if he's with someone now. For someone so good at matchmaking, is there a special someone in your life? Apart from Lady Mary on Downton Abbey. Now, can we go ahead and talk about the book? Cue Hitler cats. Don't be evasive. Well, don't be evasive. Uh, it's apparent you have everything. Why have you chosen to have no family? But why the decision to have no family? And no children. And no children. Brilliant. Zoom in on four. Here you go, Paul. Love it. Look, I love kids, but I've always found the idea of being a father myself kind of petrifying, which is why I've been drawn to algorithms. Cue Hitler cats. They're rational, reliable, predictable, everything a kid isn't. So can you have children? And can you have children, though? I mean, are the soldiers working? Are the, are the soldiers working? Well, I believe so. The barracks are in pretty regular use. Really? Really? Yes. Because for someone with a supposed algorithm for love... Isn't it odd that you've never found it? Well, I think in order to find something, you have to be actively looking for it. I've just been too busy, so I haven't... What about the Quant family bloodline? And what about the Quant family bloodline? Are there any skeletons in the closet? Sexual deviance. Sexual deviance. Oh, sorry. I don't, I don't know where we're going with all of this, but I have to tell you, I, I can attract the wrong type of women. Mm. <laughs> that's, that's, that's really great. Thanks for sharing that with us. One sec. <laughs> What are you doing? You wouldn't believe some of the weirdos that cross my path. Really? Oh, get out! Can you tell me what she's doing? Ask him something about algorithms. This has to be the last question. Ten has to be. To Lastly, algorithms. Yes. What first attracted you to them? To the logic. And... Wonderful. Jack Quant, thank you for coming on my sofa. I hope you've had as much fun as, as I have. Jesus. That's it from me. Goodbye. That was great. You look really familiar outside of being on the show. Are you on Tinder? What? Then we won't have met. No, okay.